is temperature and humidity humidum gd this is the information button this is a, this is the page button this is enter button this is up key this is down key and this is information key this is uh, alarm acknowledgement this is page button enter button up down information now page button if you press you can see the enter password enter temperature set value Tem R set value temperature low deviation temperature high deviation this is the operator parameters temperature set value temperature RH set value temperature low deviation temperature high deviation RH low deviation RH high deviation change password if you want to change the password you can change so now this is the temperature humidity temperature and set point set point is 48.5 process value 48.9 humidity 49.0 set point 48.5 now information button this is a normal temperature if it is in the set limit set value nearby if the temperature is a normal RS normal door close water level normal Now heating, if any output is started, humidifier or heating or compressor, it will start. If you want to connect the compressor, you can connect, otherwise not required. You can connect the humidifier, heating, compressor. Now, you can go to the temperature. one two three serial parameters device id one board rate parity even this is not required this is only for recording purpose now you can go to three two one This is the password is 321. Enter. Temperature setting. Alarm control sensor input. Can select alarm if required. Control tune. Set point low limit, set point high limit, proportional integral derivative cycle time. Now humidity you can set. Sensor input 0 to 5 volt. 0 to 10 volt, 1 to 5, 4 to 20, 0 to 20. Here you can select 4 to 20 as you are using humidity humidity transmitter. This is to be selected. Signal low, it will ask. You can write the signal low, 0. Signal high, 4.989. Range low, 0. Next is again you can go to three two one. Temperature set. You can sensor input you can write input type zero to zero to ten zero to one five. 4 to 20 RTD PT 100 here also you can to use 4 to 20 milliampere output 4 to 20 milliampere output required
This is the alarm sound. You change the set value. Alarm will come. This is the alarm. You can see the alarm. So alarm. You can switch off the alarm like this. When you press this one, when you press this one, the alarm will automatically deactivate it. This is the alarm acknowledgement button. Alarm acknowledgement button. So you, here you can see the, the temperature is low. That's why the signal alarm came. So now you can set again to 48.5 then the alarm is removed and it is comes to the normal state process value set value that is the condition now you can see the back side it will be like this this is the maximum This is a clamp uh, which we are doing the clamping here. You can put as something. Then again comes to here. You can see this is the back side of the humidity and temperature controller. <coughs> so here you can see this is the one input you have to give 4 to 20 milliampere here second input humidity and temperature humidity and temperature input here you can connect humidity here you can temperature or you can change also no problem this is excitation voltage if you want 24 volt will come from here you can connect to this one so here you can see the readings see the readings here you have to connect plus and minus the milliampere plus and milliampere minus you can see the milliampere plus and minus here here you have to connect plus and here you have to short t1 to t2 after shorting t1 to t2 you can connect plus milliampere minus milliampere it is coming from the transmitter so the same way this is the same way you have to connect here this is the location you have to connect this is to be shorted 25 and 26 then 26 is the plus 27 is the minus so here you are connecting humidity here you are getting temperature so both you have to do the wiring from here to the transmitter uh, again <coughs> your compressor this is the heater this humidity control compressor alarm output so here you can connect a heater you can connect do1 so here you can connect the heater plus minus again humidity required you can connect the humidity here humidity control you can connect do2 so these two only are required for you remaining not required so again you can give if you want any other output like door open if you want to connect the door open signal here a door open signal will come if you want any alarm acknowledgement signal you can connect uh, in the d14 here you can connect the alarm and uh, here is the 230 volt we are connecting here supply voltage 230 volt see this is the very important thing here we are connecting 230 volt supply then once again you can see very clearly what is happening here